Hey guys, hope you're having a fabulous day. Today we're going to be reviewing two mods actually. It's going to be the size enhancer mod. I'll show you it up at the end and right now at the end of the video and right now. And also the player resize mod. So, let's get right into them. You also may have noticed I've changed the playset a little bit. I added some trees, a car. Yeah, it's all better now. So let's go down the hallway. Here we go. Testing labs. So, let's start off with the regular size tool. You can make anything any size, because what well, well I'll get back to that. See you can even make the table bigger. But you can if you wish, you can make this the hula doll life size. Because now it's life size. Now it's flying. It also works with sofas, tables, obviously, lamps, signs, lights, and cars, but only certain si types of cars. I'll show you in a second. It also works on NPCs. So look at G-Man. He's huge now. And l look at Kleiner. You can also make them very, very small. Look at this, you can make the couch extremely small too. There we go. After spamming it. And over here are the things you can't do. You can't make ragdolls bigger, mattresses bigger, or a number two car. Wait, that's number Number two car, the one that you pick up in the there's a pull up down sir. And the doors move. See because that counts as a ragdoll, and so does the mattress. This one does not. I'll show you. So, here it is. That's the regular one. Here's the rag ragdoll one. So, there you go. And also, now let's go to the size inflator tool. Which also does not work from... Oh, no. To the best of my knowledge, does not work for ragdolls, too. It's just a more small, precise amount of growth or shrinkage. So there's a little Dr. Kleiner, make him smaller just by like a few centimeters. It's sign, let's make it bigger just a few by, by a few more centimeters. But there is an issue I've noticed with this mod. So you see that the couch is huge, tiny I mean. It still, still has its actual entity size as the size of a normal couch. Since it won't go down. This sign, you can go through. Since, see, I'll show you. I'll make it way bigger. Since its usual size is just a small size, you can literally go through the stop sign now. Because it's too big. So that's my only complaint about this mod. The NPC, NPCs seem to do everything fine, other than when they get too big, they usually break through things. So, now we're going to go on to a different mod. I'll show you that mods workshop thing right now. Okay, pause the video if you wish. Let's go on to player resize mod. So, you'd think it'd just be a little clicky thing where you just click a button and it makes you big or small. But no, you have precise amount of growth or shrinkage. And how, how much you want it to happen. And see, there's some more options for you right there. So, but the, let's go to the thing that everyone wants to hear about, the size. Let's go to the smallest one possible, which makes us so small that we can see through the world. And, and let's go to the biggest. So big that you can walk over the whole world. So, but let's go back to not so big size. So here's 3.86. It's pretty dang tall, can't fit through conventional building, buildings can't really do anything. Hey G-Man, I'm about as tall as you now. And you can go all the way up to 0 0.01 to 100. And also, there's, you swim. Your swimming is also a little different because, well, of course, you're way taller. But other than that, there is no actual differences from, from the normal size player and the small size small and big size player 
So I'm going to show you the camera right there, and this will show you how big the player gets. 3.8. Now, let's, where's that resizer? Let's go bigger. And now you're bigger. Bigger. And now you're smaller. Whee! And smaller. Whee. You're so small that no one can see you. Whoop. So it's quite a fun mod, isn't it? And, in case you want to just go back to normal size and not be a humongous giant or a tiny little squirt, you just press R, or your reload, reload button. Reload button. But you have to be holding the tool gun. Also, there's this thing I found out with the little mini sizing, that if you turn small, this. No, that's big. That's not big, small enough. You can go under stuff and hide away from other players. Useful for prop hunt or something to that nature. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video enough, please like and subscribe. I'll see you next time playing maybe Gary's Mod, Unturned, or any other thing you guys would like to suggest. Please suggest a game in the comment section below. I'd love to play it for you guys. Have a great day. Bye. Like, subscribe, share if you wish to. Bye.